Hello everyone, welcome back to my show. So as I told in the previous video, we are going to be having a pizza party. So here is the pizza sauce which I had made. Lots of it is there. So for this recipe, you are going to need some ingredients. That is all colors of capsicum. If you want, you can use one also color. Here are some uh, peels of onion and then here are some paneer coated with uh, salt and red chili powder and here is some mozzarella cheese the main ingredient ok and now we will be making this pizza with a ready made pizza base you can uh, make it uh, you can make your own pizza base also but today I am using ready made pizza base so first of all you have to take a fork and poke holes inside it and poke everywhere this helps in uh, proper cooking because th these are all raw and they get cooked we will also be needing some butter for this recipe so now just poke all the holes and once you have poked enough holes like this it's time to put the pizza sauce and this sauce I have only made is homemade so now put a good amount of pizza sauce and I prefer my pizza with a thick layer of pizza sauce so I use lots and lots of pizza sauce in each one the pizza sauce also has oregano but we will be putting oregano on top so put lots of pizza sauce if you don't like lots then you can just spread a thin layer i will be keeping a thick layer over here after this we will put one layer of mozzarella cheese and we will be making this double cheese pizza so there will be two layers of cheese so now here all the sauce is spread evenly and now we will be putting a layer of mozzarella cheese you can use already grated mozzarella cheese also so just put a thin layer of mozzarella cheese here it helps uh, for all the uh, paneer and all and this is paneer double cheese pizza which we are making so just put a very thin layer of mozzarella cheese just like this uh, and then we will be now putting the different colors of capsicum so you can arrange it or just throw it on the pizza however you like but make sure not to overcrowd the pizza here's the green capsicum and now we will be putting some onion also and we will be putting some more of this and you can decorate your pizza however you want with a smiley face of capsicum or a sad face if you are not feeling so good so now we will be putting this paneer which has been marinated for around 10 minutes in salt and red chili powder so just put it evenly so that everyone gets a good amount of paneer in this slice so just put it all over the uh, pizza and you can see the pizza is looking very colorful like a rainbow so put paneer each and everywhere and now the pizza is ready to be cooked but before that we will put a second layer of mozzarella cheese and this will be also this will be the thicker layer just put how much ever you want I prefer to put lots because I love mozzarella cheese and I like the paneer and everything to be properly coated so just put as much as mozzarella cheese as you wish and put it all over the pizza and please spread it evenly so that everything gets covered so now 
you can see that all over there is cheese now these are optional ingredients which you can put because in most pizza sauces there's already oregano but you can add some if you just love it so just sprinkle it evenly all over and make sure that you don't put too much otherwise it will be salty so spread the oregano all over and also please put a good amount of it and now if you really want some spice you can put chili flakes these chili flakes don't give lots of spice but they give some taste so just put all the chili flakes and now you can drizzle some drops of olive oil or you can put some butter I will put olive oil and now the pizza is ready to be cooked okay so we will now heat a pan with butter and then I'll show you what to do okay so now we have heated this pan now we will put some butter it would be better if you use butter and not oil so just put the butter and uh, now let the butter uh, spread everywhere this gives additional taste to the pizza base and also it does not let the pizza stick to the pan so just let it all melt and keep it on high flame and we will be putting the pizza here here's the pizza it looks so so delicious and now we will be putting the pizza inside okay so now we will have to cover and keep it for 2 minutes on high flame and 10 minutes on low flame and uh, so in total we will be taking 12 minutes to make this uh, so just cover it and keep for 2 minutes on high flame and 10 minutes on low flame okay so now we will just cover it and keep and let it cook so now on high flame okay so now we did 2 minutes on low flame uh, 2 minutes on high flame and 10 minutes on low flame so here you can see the grand pizza oh my let's take it out you can see all that cheese we also added some extra chilies because we like spicy things so now we cut it up into four pieces if you have a bigger pizza base you can cut it into more pieces also so just cut it all up and just cut it mm -mm. it smells so delicious so here you can see the cheese stretching and here we are making the second pizza also over here and we will be making this now so now let's go to the dinner table and let's see how this one tastes okay so today we have a special guest to taste my pizza so he will eat it and taste it and tell how it is okay today I am going to taste this lovely looking pizza made by our little chef Arnav it's looking so lovely that I just cannot wait to try it out it's so colorful and looking so nice and I'm, I'm sure it is tasty as well mm, it's so yummy <laughs> lovely mm, I'm going to eat up everything <laughs> Okay, so you saw how our special guest today liked it. Okay, and I will be sending the link of the sauce in the description, the pizza sauce. Okay, bye everyone and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.